All right, welcome back to the Knives Fast channel. How's it going, everybody? Say hello to Ren and Stimpy and Powdered Toast Man and Log and TV. And let's get started, guys. And we obviously have a Civivi knife to take a look at today. The Civivi Baby Banter. Black G10 handle, gray stonewash, Nitro V blade, nested liner lock, made in China. You got the great Civivi uh, zipper pouch here. It's got the cloth, nice padded. Uh, man, it, it just, they do a really good job. And guys, this is a $60 knife, uh, pretty much anywhere you look. Uh, I am reading off of the specs on White Mountain Knives, as I probably will do quite often these days since I'm an affiliate with them. And you guys can look down in the description and see a code down there, Knives Fast, for 10% off uh, on their site. Um, and right now this knife is out of stock there, but I'm sure it will be restocked soon, or it may be when you're watching this video. If not, there are plenty of other great retailers as well. Um, so this is the Civivi Baby Banter in black. Now, I'm not sure, guys, why I'm not prepared, but I'm going to reach in here and grab out my original ban banter because I forgot to have it on the table. So there it is. And this is produced by We. We and Civivi are, are you know, We's the parent company. Uh, Civivi is their more budget line. And, of course, they've got Sincut. But, um, you, you know, we haven't seen a lot out of Sincut. So I'm not sure uh, what's going to be happening. But Civivi's kind of coming up into some different steels and some different way of doing things. So that is really sweet. Now, the, the original uh, banter is this guy right here. Um, and you guys know I dig this knife. Love the way it fits in my hand. Love the absolute fidgetiness of this knife. Uh, it is middle finger flickable for me. Really, really good knife, and I love that blue. Now, this one comes by way of Mike K, a really loyal viewer of the channel, and as I said in my unboxing, Mike sent this guy along without even opening it. He bought this. He didn't even open it. He sent it for me to look at. Mike, thank you. I've done a little bit of cutting with this, uh, mostly paper. Um, kind of did open open a box. You know, as a matter of fact, I've got a package here. I'm going to throw away. So let's just. I mean, we you can just see. Uh, and again, it just goes into that paper. Uh, it cuts with that Nitro V steel really, really well. So uh, it is a capable cutter. Um, to do just about any EDC task. For me, this is a backup knife size, not a primary. Uh, you've probably seen me say that a couple of times, and that's okay. Um, so, whoops. And I can uh, middle finger flick this one. I can uh, thumb flick it, and, I mean, it's really good. So you have a nice stonewash gray finish on that Nitro V blade. You got this blue thumb stud and this great textured G10. Uh, you do have nested liners, no uh, milling to speak of. Uh, as, let's go ahead and go through the lockup. So the lockup, nice thin blade, by the way, if you didn't see that. Uh, lockup is, oh, I don't know. Let me look at it off camera for a second. I'd call that like a 30, uh, which is plenty. Nice access to the lock bar, as you can see. Um, no up and down or side to side blade play to speak of. Um, and as far as centering, I mean, I would call it just slightly off, uh, man, just ever so slightly to the show side, uh, but barely worth, man, I don't know, when you look at it like that. Let me look at it off camera again. Yeah, you know what? I think it's dead on. It's just an optical illusion. But anyway, if it is off, it's ever so slightly. You do have... If you look at the difference here, you have a 50-50 choil on the baby banter. Uh, the full-size banter does not have a finger choil. It just has the regular handle. Um, and you do have uh, the good uh, Civivi um, jumping up here on top. Again, uh, it is useful in this grip. I can, I can get a hold of it really good. Um, really nicely done, nicely built, nicely finished Knife rolled off on the edge is a little square, but that's the shape uh, that Ben Peterson liked. And I like it. You do have a tip up reversible clip, uh, and you can see those nested liners really well done there. 
Uh, I dig that. The pivot on this one is raised a little bit. So if you look at the pivot on the Wii, it is flat. Um, very flat there. This guy is raised. So I think that's a Civivi thing. Just worth pointing out. Um, I like to make sure I give you guys the differences. Again, Nitro V Blade Steel. Let's talk about, uh, let's put them pivot to pivot and zoom in. We're going to zoom in just a bit here. Whoa. Or we're, maybe we're going to zoom out. Wow. Okay. There you go. Sorry about that little ride there. Uh, the overall length of this one is five and a half or 5.46 inches. The closed length is 3.12. So again, I can't really, I cannot in this backed up grip, I can't get my pinky all the way on there. I can get it partly on there, but not all the way. But when you go up into this choil, you now have plenty of room for all four fingers. Um, so there you go. Uh, the blade thickness is 0 0.09, guys. It is slicey. Now, we've always talked about the banter uh, being really slicey. And let's see. They seem very similar on blade thickness to me. So uh, I would have to look it up. Uh, the, the banter may be slightly thicker. Uh, it's really hard for me to see, and I don't have it open right now, so, but I will check that and see if I can put it in the description. Is um, gray stone wash finished. It is flat grind, G10 handle, tip up, uh, ambidextrous carry, nested liner lock, and 1.99 ounces. Designed by the man himself, NAFS, uh, Ben Banters, Ben Peterson. Uh, ben, I really appreciate uh, you making these knives. Now, um, if I move this back down, it is very clear that I have left room for something right here. <laughs> ben, we need a Banter XL, and I know that's not your jam. I know very much, if you're watching this video, that is not your jam. Uh, it's my jam. So I need a Banter XL right here. So if you can make that happen, that would be amazing. So again, guys, uh, great little knife. And when I say little, I mean little. So this is definitely, if you watch my video uh, from um, um, a recent uh, video that I put up about small knives, and it was called, I think, something like KF Memorex because I wasn't live that night. Uh, it was a recorded version of the live. Um, you know, this is a smaller knife, and I show some comparisons with some smaller knives. Um, and let's see. Let's just show you one uh, right now. I'm not going to go into all of them because I did that in the other video. But here is uh, the CRKT Squid, which I think is a good one to show. A lot of people have a squid, and that kind of gives you a very good, uh, you know, kind of feeling for how big this knife is. Now, the blade is a little bit smaller than the squid because you have that 50-50 choil. So, again, um, you know, now, what I would love to see is a version of this banter uh, with a 50-50 choil. This size banter with a 50-50 choil right there, that would be amazing. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to change your knives, Ben. I'm sorry. Um, so there you go. There's my look at uh, the $60 Nitro V and G10 uh, Civivi Baby Banter. I really dig this knife. And Mike K, you are the man for sending this to me uh, without even getting to open it yourself. It's on its way to you. And you can enjoy this baby in your EDC uh, rotation. And I really appreciate you, man. The viewers of this channel, you guys are all uh, male, female. Every one of you guys are awesome, amazing supporters of the channel. It has been, oh, by the way, you got the What Is Up Guys logo there, the Banter logo. Same clip, by the way. You do have um, uh, good clearance and you have countersunk everything on the pocket clip. Dig that clip really really good um yeah just just well done and that's by the way uh that and that right there nitro v and what is up guys are the two only uh billboarding on the blade at all so there you go the civivi i keep wanting to call it we the civivi baby banter i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video it's a little longer but i did some comparisons as well so uh there you go thanks so much for watching and uh, give me a thumbs up and a comment down below. Let me know if it's something you're going to be picking up. And thanks so much, guys, for watching the Knives Fast channel.